ಶ್ರೀಮಾನ್ ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರ್ಯ ಕವಿತಾರ್ಕಿಕ ಕೇಸರಿ ವೇದಾಂತಾಚಾರ್ಯವರ್ಯೋಮೆ ಸನ್ನಿದತ್ತಾಂ ಸದಾಹೃತಿ ರಾಮಾನುಜದಯಾಪಾತ್ರ ಜ್ಞಾನ ವೈರಾಗ್ಯಭೂಷಣ ಶ್ರೀಮತ್ ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರ್ಯ ವಂದೇ ವೇದಾಂತ ದೇಶಿಕ ನೀಳಾತುಂಗಸ್ತನಗರಿ ಶುದ್ಧಮುದ್ಭೋತ್ಯ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪಾರಾರ್ಥ್ಯಂ ಸ್ವಂ ಶ್ರುತಿಶತಶಿರಸ್ಸಿದ್ಧಮಧ್ಯಾಪಯಂತ ಶೋಚಿಷ್ಟಾಂ ಸಜನಿಗಳಿದ ವ್ಯಾಬಲಾಕೃತ್ಯಭೂತ ಗೋದಾತಸ್ಯೈನಮೈತಮಿದೂಯೇವಾಸ್ತು ಭೂಯ ಅನ್ನವಯಲ್ಪುದುವಯಾಂಡಾಳರಂಗರ್ಕಪ್ಪನ್ನತಿರುಪಾವೈಪಲ್ಪದೀಯಂ ಇನಿಶಯಾಲ್ ಪಾಡಿಕ್ಕೊಡುತ್ತಾಳ್ ನರ್ಪಾಮಾಲೈ ಪುಮಾಲೈ ಶೂಡಿಕ್ಕೊಡುತ್ತಾಳೈ ಚೊಲ್ಲೆ ಶೂಡಿಕ್ಕೊಡುತ್ತ ಸೊಡರುಗುಡಿಗೆ ತೊಲ್ಪಾವೈ ಪಾಡಿ ಅರುಳವಲ್ಲ ಪಲ್ವಳೆಯಾಯ್ ನಾಡಿನೀ ವೆಂಕಟವರ್ಕೆನ್ನವಿದಿ ಅಂದ್ರ ಇಂ ಮಾತ್ರ ನಾಂ ಕಡವಾ ವಣ್ಣಮೇಳಲ್ಗೆ ಟುಡೇಸ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಆಳಿ ಮಳೆ ಕಣ್ಣ ಆಳಿ ಮಳೆ ಕಣ್ಣ ಒಂಡ್ರಿಣಿ ಕೈ ಕರವೇಲ್ ಆಳಿಯುಟ್ ಪೊಕ್ಕು ಮುಖಂದು ಕೊಡಾರ್ತೇರಿ ಊಳಿ ಮುದಲ್ ಒನು ರುವಂ ಪೋಲ್ ಮೈ ಕರುತ್ತೆ ಪಾಳಿಯನ್ ತೋಲ್ ಉಡೈ ಪದ್ಮನಾಭನ್ ಕೈಯಿಲ್ ಆಳಿ ಪೋಲ್ ಮಿನ್ನಿ ಒಲಂಪುರಿ ಪೋಲ್ ನಿಂಡ್ರ ಅದಿರ್ಂದೆ ತಾಳಾದೆ ಶಾರಂಗ ಮುದೈತ್ತ ಸರಮಳೈ ಪೋಲ್ ವಾಳ ಒಳಗಿಣಿಲ್ ಪೇದಿಡಾಯ್ ನಾಂಗಳೂ ಮಾರ್ಗಿಣಿ ನೀರಾಡ ಮಗಂಡೇಳೋ ರೆಂಬಾವಾಯ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಆಂಡಾಳ್ ಅಲಾಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ಹರ್ ಗೋಪಿಕ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಸೆಟ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಔಟ್ ಟು ಟೇಕ್ ದ ಸ್ನಾನ ಎ ಹೋಲಿ ಡಿಪ್ ಇನ್ ದ ರಿವರ್ ಸೊ ದ ವೆನ್ ದೇ ವರ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಟು ಸೆಟ್ ಔಟ್ ಟು ಟೇಕ್ ದ ಡಿಪ್ ದ ವರುಣ ಭಗವಾನ್ ದ ಲಾ ದ ಡೆಮಿ ಗಾಡ್ ಆಫ್ ರೈನ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ರಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದೆಮ್ all other celestial would be waiting to serve the devotees of shriman narayana all devatas come and wait to serve the shri vaishnavas so in this part from the greatness of the devotees of perumal are being told even yama says to his followers do not go near vishnu bhaktas they recite the holy name of shriman narayana such is the greatness of bhagavatas shri vaishnavas andal the very amsham avataram of bhuma devi after having seen the varuna bhagavan in front of him she thinks of the antaryame shri narayana and she addresses him you should make sure without any exception that the entire land gets a good uniform rainfall regularly pirati has got so much compassion so o aadi malai kanna the lord of rain varuna bhagavan take consume inhale lots of water from the ocean uri utpukku mugandu kuda aarteri aadi ulpuk get into the ocean and consume the oceanic waters and become fully dark rain laden cloud just about to burst into heavy downpour so you become dark hued rainy cloud so dark like that of shriman narayana and uri mudalvan uruvam pol like the primordial chief shriman narayana you should take the form the black form he is the sole savior he is the material and instrument cause of the universe uri mudalvan and andals fish that ayar padi should get lot of rains so here this the acharyas and his deeds are being talked about in this pasura acharya is the one who has full knowledge of brahman brahma gnana and he has totally dissociated himself from anything other than shriman narayana like ramanuja yonityam achyuta padambuja yugmarukma vyamogata stat itarani trinayamene asmad guru ramanuja he is he 
considers everything else as a blade of grass other than achyuta's lotus feet so the the, the shri vaishnavas the acharyas they perform the ordained duties without fail the nitya naimittika karma so one who has dipped himself in the ocean of divine attributes of paraman one who constantly contemplates of the divine kalyana gunams of paraman who sheds tears of joy with the divine glories of paraman they consume the upanishad essence vendiya vedangalodi virindu kiriyarathan for periyalvar so they take the right essence of the veda vedantam and they realize and understand comprehend the shriman narayana paratvam and understand the glories of paraman just like the cloud takes away the pure water from the salty waters of the ocean and showers on the world the cool potable water clean pure water the rain water is the purest an acharyan thus preaches the bhagavat vishayam tatvams from the veda vedantams which are the most distilled essence of vedas similar to how the clouds tend to move with breeze and cause rains at different places the acharyan moves from place to place and cause the jnana malai the knowledge of the rain of knowledge of wisdom rain of wisdom rain of truth on the shishyas on the disciples on the humanity just like the water bearing cloud an acharya is the one who gives knowledge but does not expect anything in return the cloud does not expect anything in return from the world even though it showers mess mercifully without any partiality so this pasuram teaches us that it is only through an acharya anugraham that one could attain paraman such a beautiful manner it's talked about so the direct meaning of the pasuram is that o oh lord varuna who is the presiding deity of deity of the ocean like burst of rains we pray to you so that you please do not make your gift very small it should be bounteous towards all of us towards the world the whole community we request you in the form of clouds to pour plenty of rains in abundance to the world first you should get into the womb of the deep seas and consume the excessive water so that even the sea becomes bereft of water make thunder uproar and go higher up in the sky the color should be completely dark with full of rain bearing and that and it should be like that of the primordial cause uri mudalvan jagat karana bhutan you should become resplendent with lightning just as the chakra idam in the peruma in the hand of peruman and you should you should make a thunderous roar like the conch pancha janyam the shankhe which is held in the peruman but in the hand of peruman you should bring forth the rains in abundance without any huddle without any stop interruption the rains just like the shower of arrows coming from in succession from the sargam of the lord your rain should be for the good of the world for the benefit of the world so that the whole world flourishes through your rains we will have plenty of water and happily take the ceremonial bath during the margari sharanagati nonbu lord vishnu's important weapons chakram shank sargam are all referred to by andal here in the form of um, in the form of prayer worship in the form of invocation and lord padmanabha is indicated as the jagat karanan so here paalyantolai padmanaban kayil aali pol minni valam puri pol nindru adirndu taalade vaala shargam udaitha saramalai pol ulaginil vaala peididai and the inner meaning as we talked about are the venerable acharyas they pour down the rain of gnanam to the disciples to the to the humanity to the world and their eyes are always flooded with the showers of anandam bliss joy happiness because of 
their Bhagavat Anubhavam and they get goosebumps. They have tears of Anandam. Please bless us with all the meanings of the three Ragasyams, O Acharyas, without holding back any after entering the milky ocean of Upanishads, taking the essence, the meanings and roar like a lion. You Acharyas who have the dark hue of the Lord, who always contemplate of the dark hue of the Lord, you also shine like the Lord, the resplendent like the Lord, because you who are filled with infinite daya and similar to Piriman, you are the embodiment, the personification of His daya. You have the same tejas, jyotish, like Sriman Narayana. You shine, you roar, and paramata nirashanam, and you establish the unambiguous and the unparalleled Vishishta Dvaita Sri Vaishnava Sampradayam, Vaidika Matam. And you, there will be, if you, if you roar like Hayagriva Gosham, there will be complete inauspiciousness. There will be, there will be complete auspiciousness and the absence of inauspiciousness and it, there will be uh, there will be no mangalam if you do not perform upadesam to your shishyas so you should shower the jnana varsham so that we all will get benefited with sarva mangalams like a torrent sara marai pole the jnanam should should fall on us should be showered on us it is required for the people of the world to survive and live you should also, like rain, you should move from place to place. Please rain the knowledge with joy so that we will engage in the Marga Sirisham, the, the ultimate Margam, the way of Sharanagati, of Prapati, at your sacred feet. Sadacharya serving as Karunyamrita Megams, clouds that shower compassion, clouds that shower Daya. Clouds that shower mercy. So in the in the last verse, Ongi Walahalanda, Andal compared Acharyas to Vallal Pirum Pashukkal as the most generous and most merciful cows that give milk to the humanity. They, the Acharyas were compared to the cows. The Sishyas, through the Anugraham of these Acharyas, drink the milk of Jnana. Now, in this Pasuram, Aryamalekana, Acharyas are compared to the dark, rain-laden, thick clouds, monsoon clouds, that pour down Jnana on those who seek their refuge, who look up to the clouds and wait for the clouds to fall. So, the, the, they the Sishyas get uplifted by the Acharyas from the, from the scorching heat of samsara, from the scorching samsaric afflictions and prepare them for Moksha Siddhi for, uh, and to perform the sacred Atma Samarpana. Acharya Ramanuja is a Daya land and rain cloud. There are very many ways we, Swami Desikan talks about in Yetiraja Saptati comparing Acharya Ramanuja to the rich daya laden cloud cooling us, cooling samsaris with uplifting us through the downpour of divine jnana. So the Tripavai Pasuram Vratam observers are Paramaikantins who will not worship anyone other than Sriman Narayana and will not ask anything for themselves. Hence, they will not pray to the rain god Varunan for boons to bless them with abundant showers. Here, gopis address the god of rain as Ali Malai Kannan. Kannan is the name for the, the commander of the rain clouds. He is the Antaryami of the clouds. The gopis address him as the Jnana Vairagya Karunya Kalyana Guna Samudram. So, they invoke him for blessing us, blessing them with the 
abundant rain for the subhiksham of the world thus it is it is a great pasuram that glorifies the sadacharyans and their mercy on us adigen andal trivadigale sharanam danyosme